sentimental video for the 14th of April 2021 for the Quasi DB service. Gold signal, technical signal is to buy, sentimental signal is saying to sell. Dynamically, if you can see, they're slightly going long and that action uh, could be quite bearish because if they go long, their stops are going to be lower down and the price could come down to take their stops. Um, and also, do forget this uh, 1750 line as well. That had some technical resistance here. Oh, actually, so it had some, a bit of a sell off. So, that level is important. And you've got MR1 at 1752. If we go to the daily, actually, this auto trend line is actually identified quite an interesting resistance. If I zoom out, um, let's have a look at this. I think it had. Yeah, these two. Yeah, so if we can draw a line, it's not like the most amazing line, but kind of respected. See, auto trend line did calculate it finally. Uh, it's those two, these two uh, wicks, it respected exactly, and then it hit those two as well. And the lines converge at R1, MR1. Can you see? At 1752. So we're coming up to a very key level on gold. Break above that, then we'll target M. MR2, which is 1797, and then it'll be um, it'll be horrendous if you're short because that's a big big gap up to resistance. So we are coming up to a very critical junction um, for gold. So 1752, remember, and on the daily basis as well. So breaking that would be quite strong. Um, AJ SRC taken uh, 83.65. Uh, 82 99 83 by weight AU and uh, we're above monthly pivot now so keep that in mind we have got this signal which is awesome um, 7690 at 7559 by by so there's a match and we're above monthly pivot so do keep that in mind EA I needed this to fall. This is one of the reasons why I'm quite grumpy yesterday. It's because it, this continued to rally, and it really shouldn't have done. And then we got MR1 resistance as well. So once I saw that come into play, I was a little bit more confident. 15643. So we had multiple tests, and I was like, oh, good, because I was short, and I was going to get stopped out, and it would have been quite a loss. But fortunately, we had MR1 resistance, which is awesome. Uh, one above, which wouldn't have been my stop, it was too far, 15710, and one below is 15544. Sell, sell, another match. EU, um, MR1 is 11994. You can probably guess what the SLC is, it's 1.2 on the dot. Uh, one below is 118.53. There's your monthly pivot. So we are bullish above by weight. Um, so yeah, obviously if we risk on, this is going to help this one. So keep an eye on the US 500. Uh, another one of our signals um, might wrap up today. I think we we would have done quite well. One point three point eight. Oh, got the new one. Sorry, one point three eight fifty. So they just moved it up fifty pips. That was their moving their stops, uh, which is quite a good you know um, example of them being typically uh, counter trend. They could be right. Uh, we are below monthly pivot, don't forget. Monthly pivot is at 138.23. SSC below uh, 13660. They could be right. Um, yeah, we'll have to wait and see. So that's them selling it. So that would that push price up. NU on above 71.15. Below 69.95. Wait, buy. UEN. Uh, 13089 and 12950 by weight pound gen sideways um, 15101 and 14950. This is a large stop loss cluster. Anything over 5%, you know, it's worth noting by weight dollar yen um, 10906 and 10870. Buy, wait, dollar uh, CAD. Now, this is what I was saying about how we should avoid this um, <laughs> particular pink line, which is monthly pivot. So, crossed above, below, 
above, hit, up, down, up, down. And we I don't know, we're currently below, so just avoid this one. It's gonna be horrendous. Uh if you did want to trade it, keep an eye on one, two, five, five, five. There's your monthly pivot, but it's probably going to uh, act it uh, like a magnet and will come up and up and down or chop up and down again. Sell, wait, dollar Swiss, big long trend line resistance uh, on above 92.20 and one below is at S1 at 91.84. And there's the gold, which is actually currently um, having a, a little doji there, which is indecision. On the daily, we've just—it's still early days, um, but yeah, keep an eye on that level. It's 17.52. I'll wrap it now, and I'll speak to you guys later. I'll do the signals overview now, and we should be in nice profits. Uh, fingers crossed, and I'll uh, tell you what's what then. And I'll speak to you later.